Number one seed versus number one seed. North America versus EU. The rivalry shall continue. It is time for Flipside Tactics versus NRG as we get ourselves into this matchup. Greasy Meister does not end up winning that kickoff, but it's Cooks here who clears that one away. Over to Fireburner, but over to Greasy, who is immediately trying to get that one into a danger area. Flipside Tactics need to start this one off well. Fireburner gets it open to the corner, just trying to slow the pace very slightly, but Marky Duda has that one red early on, and Sad Jr. with the eventual clear away, but Greasy once again getting rid of it. Flipside Tactics are going to continue to press and squeeze, and they cannot quite find a way through, but they are still in this final third. Fireburner is going to try and clear it away, and Jacob gets an extra touch. Great start there by Flipside. The high volleys from Flipside are putting NRG in immense amounts of pressure. They're trying their best to bat it away, but Greasy almost had a fantastic opportunity. Let's hope they can retreat on defense. Oh, almost, almost an opportunity. Almost managed to find their way through there. NRG strong on the counter, always dangerous when they find the ball. Marky Duda tries to get himself up, but ends up missing. Greasy Meister off the side wall. Cooks thinks better of going towards it because he's got Fireburner lurking behind him. Cannot afford to let that go through to someone as dangerous as shooting as Fireburner. Now Cooks gets that one out of the way of Fireburner. Marky Duda gonna try and find someone. No, he looks for it off the backboard, but it's a modish on Greasy Meister. Does not matter because Greasy scores the first goal. The typical flip side aggression. We see this pop perfect for Marky Duda, sucking out Jacob, trying to get him in there, and then an attempt at the crossbar. You never know where that's gonna bounce. He just missed right in and gave Cooks here all the room in the world. We know he's a fantastic striker and an open net he's not gonna miss. Cooks it very brave and smart there. He saw the demolish on Greasy, turned himself around because usually we'd see him starting to head back in the rotation there. Instead, turning himself around, getting the shot onto target, and that's gonna hand over the early lead to Flipside Tactics as Sad Jr. over the top of two players, but Greasy has that one covered, and the rest of his team is gonna get themselves back as NRG try and put some together. Marky Duda up high, one touch, two touch. He hasn't got the boost for a third as Jacob takes that one away. Breezy sits there, but he's got Fireburner in his way. Sad Jr. takes his time because he's got Jacob moving forward. Sad Jr. runs out of the ability to go forward with that as Fireburner has to get the save. Cooks it on the side. Looks for a flick up, but nothing quite there. Pace starting to slow down very slightly in this matchup, but he gets cleared over into the middle. Flipside's gonna want to slow it down a bit. They are now one up. They don't want to commit too much at the problem they had throughout league play. You know, they want to get these shots up, but sometimes they can't get back on defense. Ball up high. Here comes Marky Duda. Plays it early. He gets Sad Jr. to move, but Sad gets contact, but it has pulled him out for the time being. Fireburner is in net, and Sad Jr. continues to go with this ball, but Marky Duda in the way. They are going to try and read every single play NRG do to keep that in that final third, but is eventually cleared away. Breezy Meister. He's not going to win that. Neither of them are, as Jacob gets that one over. He's got Sad Jr. to aim at. Sad Jr. into the middle. Great oh! team play, but a block from Cooks here. Still, NRG are in possession as the ball is over to Jacob. Jacob, ball up high. Fireburner gets his shot taken away from him by Cooks there, who was on the wall. Sad Jr. with aggressive placement, able to get an interesting pass from the corner. That's what we know they can do. We talked about NRG having some wild card plays, and that was a prime example. Jacob with the flick. Oh, and he's got a goal to aim at. Oh! oh! Jacob evens up the match. Jacob calm and collected during this dribble, getting his first flick, sucking out a defender, then keeping this nice and low. Trying to bait that goalie up. Cooks here tried to get it, tried to predict the top shot, but Jacob patiently put it on the ground. Put it on the ground indeed. Cooks had to jump for that one. It had to try and guess where Jacob's gonna try and go. And he did almost guess it correctly. But now we are tied up, heading into the final minute and 50 seconds of this matchup. Cooks it up high. He's got Marky in support. As Marky gets beat to it by Jacob, but here he is yet again. Cooks backflip. Breezy has to try and cover him, but there was no one from NRG trying to chase them down on that one. Fireburner has basically just passed it out, but Greasy gets in the way of Cooks' attempted shot. Back into the middle, Sad Jr. Nice flick, looks for Jacob. Jacob! No way! Oh, oh my play. god! The tournament! This passing play is phenomenal! Able to look out for your teammate, Sad Jr. Down to Jacob, who taps it right back into Sad Jr. In the same aerial. My god, this is incredible! You just saw NRG snap! The F3 defense apart. 2-1, a minute and 30 seconds left in this match. F3 have to respond. Breezy up high with that, but both Marky and Cooks have followed it. Marky uses the roof, trying to get himself back down. 
And that's going to be a bump on Sad Junior to Cooks here. Fireburner wins that ball, Whoa. and he has increased the lead. Fireburner seizing an opportunity at an open net. It looked like F3 may have committed a bit too hard for this. Cooks are getting bumped, and then Greasy trying to get there in time. But Fireburner just slips just right by, giving them a two-point lead with only a minute 12 left. Flipside looked like they got a little bit antsy there. They had time to try and find that one goal. Now they are further behind the fake kickoff. Can we see it pulled off well? Maki Duda <laughs> misses his attempted pass. It was worth trying out. This is the big stage, however, and the mechanics have to be on point. Plays like that have to be pulled off well. Cooks up high. Tries to get that one over, but Sad Jr. has got him red off the side of the wall. No one there to follow that one up. Cooks has to turn himself around, gets bumped away. Marky tries to find something, but Sad Jr. is easily going to claim that one. Only over to Greasy. Great shot from Greasy. Fireburner turns that one away. As now Jacob down. Two players committed to that one. Marky Dudar tries to launch it long, but Fireburner yet again save your medal for him. But the ball is still not away. NRG are going to be pressed, but if they can get it away, they can at least get themselves even closer to that win. 22 seconds remaining for a goal for Flipside, and it looks like they are struggling to find that space. They're gonna try, look, they're just looking for each other every single touch. Jacob now gonna take a shot on net! NRG have turned up to this first game in the biggest of ways. However they woke up this morning, I hope they do it again because the fire is burning with them right now. Jacob taking that shot to the corner. My God. What a great first game we have seen from NRG showing up and they have dismantled Flipside Tactics in this first game. Jacob oh, has no. made it five. Just take the salt off the table and just pour it in the wound. Already a three-point lead. Turn into a four-point lead. Jacob with the redirect to the crossbar. Very similar to what we saw Garrett pull off yesterday. They are in a great spot to continue on the rest of this series. Would have heard even louder noise, but this game is academic at this point. Flipside Tactics need to find the answer to NRG because they are here to play. Ball touches the floor, first game to NRG. NRG looking like they could be the North American heroes that North American fans are looking for. What a showcase of skill. Every single goal on the highlight reel. Not one of those goals wasn't incredible, aside from one goal the Fireburner got on overcommit from Flipside Tactics. But, oh, I don't even know how to describe what I just watched. To kick off today with such fantastic Rocket League is phenomenal.